1 Corinthians 12 verses 5 and 6, Paul says, There are differences of ministries, but the same Lord. And there are diversities of activities, but it is the same God who works all in all. David's story is a perfect example of this, and we'd like to take a few moments to share how one Saturday morning, God started changing his life. It was Sabbath morning. I remember that day very well. It will never be erased from my mind. I woke up very early for work, like always, and Saturdays there usually isn't traffic. The roadways are usually clear, so I arrive to work very early. Tuning to the radio in my van, my work van, I usually turn into radio station 1030 AM, Radio Poder, a Christian radio station. I've always liked listening to Christian messages. The preacher from the radio station was announcing that all church services were beginning at 9.15 a.m. That drew my attention and I was curious. That is when I made the decision to write down the number that the pastor had announced over the radio. After calling the station, David was contacted by the nearest church in his area. He started regularly attending church with his family. In December 2010, David decided to give his life to Jesus. I remember perfectly that night in December. December 8th. The day I made the decision to give my life, my whole self, to Jesus Christ. A few days earlier, I had received a call from Pastor Barrios. I'll never forget what he said. This is the week of your salvation. And I made that decision. It was like that that day. I remember that night. It was very cold. Very cold. December 8th, a very special date. It's also the date of my sweet daughter's birthday. It was that night that I decided to give my body and soul to Christ. Soon after his baptism, David was invited to the Evangelism Festival in Ocean City. At the time, David was out of a job, so the church aided him and made it possible for him to attend. It was at Ocean City that he was introduced to Seda in the School of Theology. I began to ask, what is Seda? It was then that pastors and members began to explain to me what it was. Brother Arnaldo, he was graduating that day, motivated me to begin attending classes. Now I am enrolled in the school, glory be to God. I have been attending these classes that have been very helpful. They are helping me to get to know more about Christ. Now that David has given his life to Jesus and learned more about the God who changed his life, he wants to share this good news with others. In my heart is an outpouring of the need to also share this richness with my wife, my family, and my daughters. And on Friday, we are taking small time for refreshment in the Word, the Word of God. We're studying la fe de Jesus, the faith of Jesus. I want to make the calling to all the members, to everyone in general, really from the bottom of my heart, that we support these ministries, the ministries of the radio, the ministry by which I came to know the Word of God. I came to know the love of God. In the same way also Seda. For me, Seda, the School of Theology, is a marvelous experience. It's a foundation of living water through which we come to know the Word, the true Word of Christ that in turn we may also be able to share this marvelous message with the rest of the world.